Hey folks, this is Vagrant. Welcome back to Dying Light 2. The weird FPS issue seems to have disappeared. You know, you guys, uh, I, I went and watched the video back and it was mad <laughs> for you guys. It was like four frames every 10 minutes. For me, it was very laggy, but it was actually working. So I apologize that that cutscene cut cut has been absolutely butchered, but uh, really not much I could do about it. That's a nice place. Don't get comfortable. We don't need another roommate, especially one that could rob us while sleeping. Not every pilgrim is a criminal, you know. Uh-huh. You have a nice workshop here. Assembling UV lamps, huh? Yeah. You shouldn't be here. Hakan's risking our asses. Yeah, yeah. Get the hell out. I'm sorry. I guess I scared you, huh? Felt better after I hit you. Or even. Yana. Aiden. What is this place? Our home. Our workshop. Our whole world, you might say. You're nicer than she is. Hey, back off. Sarah doesn't trust anyone but me. Besides, I'm a better fighter than she is, so I can afford to be more open. Okay. Infective playing card, Ace of Spades. Demolisher. <gasps> Do I get to collect the whole deck? Maybe just the face cards? Supposed to go with hack on? Yeah, but I'm stealing from you. Alright? <laughs> you know, give me a minute to rob you before I leave. Okay, so we are in the city, I believe. Yeah, cool. <laughs> Not bad. Where's the fish eye? The canteen is there. In the center. Past the chemical dumps. Uh, I need to get there. Too bad. Only way to go is through the tunnel. They protect it like a portal to the fucking Valhalla. Near impossible to get through. It's my specialty. Where's the tunnel? <laughs> Not so fast, cowboy. You won't get far without a biomarker. You are a threat to everyone. And you've already seen how people in Villador react to a threat. Well, can you help me? You seem to be familiar with the city. I've lived in this city since before the world got fucked up. I could help you, but... You need a biomarker. You won't get far without it. Where are you from? Pretty far, I guess. About 2,000 kilometers. Oh, shit. How the heck did you not get infected? That's easy. Didn't let him bite me. Here it's different. Here we're all infected. Heard of Haran. They isolated Villador too. They built walls. They locked us in. Turned out to be the thing that saved us. And how do you get a biomarker? Uh, you can't get them. Unless you know the right people. And I do. Let's go. That's By lovely how. I'm Hakon. Hey, Hakon. I'm Aiden. I'm Aiden. Nice to meet you, Aiden. Welcome to paradise. It's quite nice looking. I like the slight increase in uh, foliage we've got going on. Hey, that's how you extend the hood. Okay, let's get a move on. I'm a bouncy mongoose. Never let anyone tell you different. Ow. Oh, you do know the moves. I was in the military. Special unit? For seven years. I even liked it, except when I didn't. For insubordination, got blacklisted and they zeroed my bank account. Ended up driving a cab. Ouch. Now the mighty have fallen. <laughs> Fuck you. At least I got to know my way around the city. Oh, come on. Eh. Okay, so that's actually a thing. That wasn't a thing last time, was it? You're too weak. Without an inhibitor, you won't last. That hey, your uh, everything in sight last time you gave it to me. Stamina drains while climbing. But then it gets better eh? if you survive, <laughs> of course. Catch! Thanks, buddy. You're telling me I could have died? If I hadn't given it to you, you would have died anyway. Okay, interesting. Do 
Got some Scrapola. It's one of those games where I, I understand the games have to be the way they are, right? Otherwise, people would go mad. People would die. But, ooh, lavender. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, resin. Ooh, chamomile. It's like a like a garden kind of thing. Garden little setup. Got a beehive. It's pretty cool. <clears throat> but I find with games like this and games with Far Cry and stuff like that, they these open world games. I'm always just waiting for the time that I kind of just get to do my own thing. I understand that we have to sit through this kind of bit. I do. But I'm always waiting for the open world bit to begin. You know, the freedom. So that's the bit I like, and that's why we play these games, right? Alright, Hakon. This is a gorgeous game. So, why are you helping me? I know people are generally scared of you guys. But one pilgrim saved my life. I was a pilgrim. Now I'm infected. It'll be much harder to travel. Then welcome to your new beginning, my friend. Check out this place. They're like treasure chests. Usually got good stuff in them. Check it out. I'll wait. Oh. Uh, I've already looted everything you own, Hakon, so... Uh... <laughs> While traversing through Villador, look out for roof groves, places of dense vegetation, recognisable by tall yellow trees. They're a great source of honey, chamomile, other resources you can use to craft medicine over consumables. Also find some forgotten weapons. Cool. Nice idea. Makes sense. Oh no. Is the game going to bug out because I've already... Right, okay, that's how I get this chest. I was wondering before. Clearly, I was meant to be allowed in here, but... Uh, what earth is that? Crystals. Someone must have stashed them here. They formed after the chemicals were dumped on us. Some believe they delay infection. Folk superstition. So you don't collect them? Sure I do. Superstitious people pay a fortune for them. And I am always happy to take someone's cash. There's one specific chest I'm after. Come on, let me show you. All right, buddy. I feel like I need some health. Man. <laughs> the parkour in this game does feel so good. Makes me want to play Mirror's Edge. I'm just going to assume this is the right way. You're a bit of a slow park, aren't you, Hakon? So tall yellow trees on, is a roof on. grove. Stop. So, you have an army here? Ugh, the peacekeepers. They treat people like that too. Watch out for them. They guard the tunnel you want to go through. My, I wonder if we'll be doing a favor for them to be allowed access at some point. <laughs> Tell me more about them. They consider themselves righteous protectors. Uh, they are good at killing infected, so you got to give them credit for that. Yeah, pretty efficient killers. Yeah, but their righteousness comes with a price. Always remember this. You either play by their rules, or you're fucked. Their protection of the bazaar is more like an occupation. On the trail, I met a lot of tough guys who talked about the new order. It always seemed like the same old shit to me. Yeah, it's like that here too. And the PKs are getting worse. I'll proceed with caution. Good. Though it might not help. The PK are a pain. Seriously riling up the bazaar, folks. The bazaar is a box of dynamite one spark away from blowing up. Hey, are we going? You uh, wanted to show me something? Sure, follow me. I heard that there are, <clears throat> I, th I think, three factions in the game, PK being one of them, and that will make decisions that determines, you know, what land they take and how that faction rules and all this kind of jazz. Yellow, that means I can climb it. I'm inside you. Hit. Oh, God, that was close. First thing I need to do is bump my bloody stamina up. Yeah, 
know, if he was a little bit quicker, we wouldn't be having a bloody problem. <laughs> Let's scout around. Almost there. I hope there are no surprises. That looks nice. I've not seen another one of these rooftop gardens. They are about to wake up. Quickly, open the chest. What chest? Not chest. In return, we'll get your biomarker. Fuck. Thieves. Wait. No, 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 leave it. Mess up that lock and everything's fucked anyway. Enough for a biomarker? Where'd you get that? I've been all over this city more than most, but even I haven't seen working GRE equipment for years. I can't say much, but a former GRE scientist, Dylan, gave it to me. A guy named Waltz killed him. And before he died, Dylan gave me the key to keep it from Waltz. It contains important information, apparently. I hope to find out more at the fisheye. We'll have to see, won't we? Uh oh. Fuck me. We took too long. Plan B. Run like hell. Hakon seems like a good dude. I felt like I could trust him. I love that they you can see they've got the biomarkers on, but they've turned, so they're just flashing red. UV light is a symbol of safety at night. It is the only certain protection from infected. Watch out for it when you're being chased. Hold RT to survivor fence. Survivor sense marked as the new source of UV lamp at night with the UV lamp icon. Let's go. It's over there. They're close. Go on. Run away, run away, run away. God, this game is pretty. <laughs> is this a thing? Let's find out. I don't bloody know. Ah. <laughs> there was an arrow. <laughs> I just went for the arrow. Yeah, I should have gone that way. <laughs> its way was much more intelligent than my way. Oh, it's very pretty at night time. <laughs> Hello. Stand in the light. Hakon, uh, come on, open up now. Hakon, a howler's coming. Oh, fuck. Biomarkers. There's no time. We've got the howler on our asses. Biomarkers. Did you hear behind us? I said biomarkers. Here. And his? He's with me. I have to see his biomarker. Let us just inside the door at least. I need to see his biomarker. How about some electronics, huh? Fucker. Acting his friends. There's no time. Run, Aiden. All right. Chase. Okay. At least the nighttime bonus is back. I, I need to heal, man. I wrecked myself earlier. <laughs> Game, I know I'm low in health, all right? I get that. Oh no. Ugh. I need to heal. Ah, <laughs> oh, there we go. Killian, it's me. Up and up. My friends here, huh? Killian, keep them busy. <clears throat> Short, yeah, easier said than done. Stop 
Alright. They're aggro at night, aren't they? <laughs> There's always time to loot. Trophies. I think so. Help me. All right. Old world whiskey. You know what? Whis Whiskey's one of those things I really want to get into. Oh god. La zombie. La zombo. As they say. So fucked. Should have waited a while longer. Almost did. Didn't want to clean your guts off my doorstep in the morning. They've left, so can you. Oh, come on, stop being such a bastard already. Look at this. Where did you? That's rare. Invite us in, or it'll get even more rare. Who is this? I'm a pilgrim. Haven't been here long, have you? How did you get into town? I'll tell you everything. Just let us in. I waited for a pilgrim once. He was supposed to. Ah, oh, forget it. Doesn't matter anymore. What are you up to, hack on her? I gave him an inhibitor. He survived. Are you mad? He needs a biomarker. Don't have one. Bullshit. Seriously. <sighs> Motherfucker. The hospital then. I was hoping to avoid it. Always looking for an easy way, huh, hack on? I just need a UV lamp. I'll come back for you. Hold tight. Hack on. Why are you helping him, huh? Remember when we used to help people? Me? Sure. But I doubt you do. Stay here and rest by the lamp. Don't listen to that dumbass. <sighs> Idiot. We used to help people, remember? Sure, I remember you. People in this game have a really weird perspective on um, pilgrims. It seems like we're just messengers slash people who, you know, do deliveries across the wasteland because we're good at avoiding zombies and stuff. Why is that a scary thing? Why is that something that people people fear and act really weird about? Like, why is that a big deal? I, I don't I don't get that at all. Wait till morning. Mustache. Okay, I've got so many weapons. Can we turn these into scrap like good in the last game? We cannot. That is no longer a thing. Okay, interesting. The whole scrapping mechanic has been annihilated. Let's chat. What are you cooking? Pickles? You don't cook pickles. You wanted something else. Higher fucking causes. And you can just cook. Pickles. You and Hakon. You known each other long? Too long. What did he mean when he said that you used to help people? We served together in a special... Ah, uh, doesn't matter. Ancient history. It's in the Illuminati. It says the Temple of Geeks. 
Biomarkers. Why are they so hard to get? Because they're complicated devices. Hell, the factories that made them have been out of commission for years. Biomarkers are key to blood. They can't be reused after someone sinks with it. Without them, the infection runs unchecked. Like what's happened to you. That's why people pay a fortune to get a new one. All the money and crystals they have. Fortunately, me and Hakon found a place where they can still be made. This sweater is lovely. Temple of Geeks is an interesting badge because I assume it's meant to be a reference. It's, it's some geek club or maybe like a tech support thing. And he seems like a, he looks like a techie kind of guy at some point. But geek is another word for zombie in quite a few different medias. What did I watch just the other day where they called them geeks? I don't remember. What's wrong with Hakon giving me inhibitors? Kills most people in seconds. It's a powerful drug. Most can't handle it. But I survived. I said most. So don't get excited. Just be careful with them. I love your accent. Where can I rest? So you just got into town. What brought you here? This ain't the promised land. Far from it. I need to get to the fisheye. And Hakon's helping you get there? You seem like a good kid, but... Take my advice. Don't go doling out trust like Penny Candy. Hell, how do you know you can trust me? Okay, enough jabber. Go to sleep. Nothing to be done till morning anyway. Hmm. Hmm. Why is he making cherry jam, pickles, cheese? <laughs> Maybe it's meant to be sauerkraut? Not sure. Bedtime. I sleep. funny. Did you make it? Almost. Biomarkers are at the GRE hospital. I'll be there shortly, but to get the job done, I need you to join me. Where should I go? With Killian's door to your back, you'll be pointing right at it. Hold the line. Stop. There's a little book gone. There's a little book. Oh, I love the morning. At night, the city rooftops are teeming with infected to say safe the streets use the rooftops to travel. When on the street level, avoid howls at all costs. If they see you, they alert over infected and start a chase. During a chase, be on the lookout for hiding spots on the rooftops or hide within beams of UV light. Wait. Keep to the roofs, because if the howler spots you... Isn't it morning? Yeah, I know. <laughs> Don't want to go up against any of those anytime Wasn't soon. Wasn't that the whole point? <laughs> it's morning? Whoa, okay, there's loads of them. Once I was taking my second wife to the hospital. Never drove that fast in my life. Her waters broke three months early. You have kids? There was no saving that one. And other than that, none that I know of. Sorry. It's fine. What normal person would want his kids to see a world like this? Ow. Game, stop telling me to turn my flashlight on. I just think the game looks cooler without the flashlight. <laughs> I'm not doing it for any reason other than that. Alright, so I need a bit of a run up here. Allons-y. Uh, what are we landing on? What's the point in that? How is that a jump? I don't understand. There's a big ass arrow. Am I meant to be aiming for something there? Wait, what was that timer? Right, let's try that again, shall we? Yeah, I know. Don't want to go up against any of those anytime soon. I'm sure there's something to jump onto and I miss it, but I feel like the arrows in this game have <laughs> to get me killed several times. Never drove that fast in my life. Our waters broke three months early. You have kids. There we go. There was no saving that one. 
And other than that, none that I know of. Sorry. It's fine. What normal person would want his kids to see a world like this? There you go. The lock is broken. Don't worry. Find the old bus. A bus? At zero hour, a bus crashed into the hospital. It broke through the wall. You can use it to get inside. Since no one could get in, there's a good chance there'll be some markers left. Man, I don't know what it is. There's something about the game. It just looks so much better than the last one did. Maybe it's just the graphics? Is it, is it just graphic fidelity? I don't know. There's like a... A darkness to it. It's much creepier than the last game was. Eve. <clears throat> Houndfield, neutral territory, two to four. I can trust him, right? He seems like a good lad. Everyone seems like a good lad until they eat your face, you know? <laughs> right. this way. Big building, Keep protective gear on at all times. THV ward. But it's loot. Game. It's loot. See it. I want it. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Not allowed to explore yet. One day though. Why are there crystals everywhere? We don't have much time. Stay close to me. Man, I've got to say, I would be awful at this, right? Like, <laughs> I like trying to get fitter at the moment, everything like that. But I mean, at this current point in time, I would, I would just be dead in a zombie apocalypse. If I'm totally honest with myself. Um, but man, if you were properly set up, if you were able to do this, jump around the buildings and all that kind of stuff, the zombie apocalypse could be a lot of fun. Doors locked. You know how to open locks? Sure. Turn the key. What if you don't have a key? Back on. I've traveled thousands of kilometers. You think doors are a problem for me? <laughs> okay, just checking. I think this room should have all the instruments you need, Maestro. Now let me in, or? I found some scrap. You can make lockpicks out of that. Ah, sweet. Crafting! What's this mean? Oh, it's immunity. Immunity allows you to remain in darkness longer. Immunity increases automatically every time you level up stamina or health. So I have to choose stamina or health. Yeah. Uh, lockpick. Ah, good work. Thanks. Use lockpick to open locked doors and containers. Lockpicks can be easily crafted from scrap. Make sure you craft them frequently. To pick a lock, make sure you. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> it, it's basically Skyrim lockpicking. <laughs> It's just a lockpicking game that makes sense, you know, and every game will continue to use it for all of time. Uh -huh. You didn't lie. You know your stuff. I had no other choice. Was forced to know my stuff. There's a weird vibe to the whole situation. I just don't quite trust it. <sighs> what the hell? I wish this stuff stayed on longer as well. We're having to rescan every five seconds. It's quite annoying. But maybe that's an upgrade we can get later on. <clears throat> Hagon seems like a good lad, right? He wouldn't try to kill me. Or do something crazy. I mean, he's doing something crazy constantly, but that's <laughs> unrelated. That's a hide area there. I better keep those in mind. Also, I've got to say, I very rarely encounter resin in my day-to-day -day life. <laughs> you 
Aiden encounters it constantly in his life, apparently. People just store resin absolutely bloody everywhere. Fireflies are about as well. Is it, just, is it marking a hide area? What is it doing? It's nice though. Jeez. Aiden, everything okay? Yeah. Are you sure? God. Talk to me. I'm just feeling woozy all of a sudden. It must be the infection. Don't give in. We'll get you a marker and you'll know where you stand. Just gonna keep a little bit of information to myself, I think. Just a little bit, not too much. But a little bit now, I have to be a little... A little, little, little bit, hedge my bets a little bit, you know, just in case. I don't know if it's that kind of game, really, but just in case. Where's he gone? How did he get away so fast? He is speed. But what he does not know is that I am also speed. Together we shall be speed. This is fine. Everything's fine. Nothing to see here. Oh, ho, ho, hello. <laughs> oh. Ho, ho. That felt loud. <laughs> that felt very loud. I can use my light, can't I? Yeah. I am generally speaking going to try to keep the light off. This way. Nothing to see here, zombies. Nothing to see here. Nothing at all. No delicious humans. Crystals are everywhere. Around the bodies, look. Game, stop telling me to turn on my flashlight. I haven't turned it on for a reason, you know? What is that? Chemicals. Nasty shit. When they lost control of the virus, the GRE started spraying the whole city with that filth. Worked out great for them, huh? 
Mm -hmm. I don't add drama to the situation. You should appreciate me adding drama to your game. Oh, hello. What have we got here? Juice? Nate Market. Kiwi juice. I'd go for some kiwi juice. If I have kiwi juice, I love a good kiwi. <clears throat> Side note, you should eat the skin on kiwis, okay? What is this? Oh, pigment, it's cool. Uh, there's a lot of something... Oh, there's loads of stuff in there. Lots of loads of enemies, but that's neither here nor there. So, this guy you told me about, what was his name? Waltz? Yes. Why did you mention him? Because I remember he was doing some kind of experiment. <sighs> he wasn't the only one doing them. There were more cities like Villador. With walls cut off from the rest of the world. Many people were working toward a vaccine, Aiden. But, well, the world is full of shitheads. A spawn. A spawn. Wings? Oh, it's got the bloody lights on. <laughs> okay, cool. I mean, it's a hospital. Great places to suck up. Terrible place to go during a zombie infection. Zombie apocalypse, whatever you want to call it. Pigments for days. Why does the hospital have all these pigments? I have no idea. Let's shut up. All right. <laughs> Jesus. You can't jump that. That's bad. Be careful. It's not stable. I want to loot the vending machine. Aiden, don't jump. There's a vending machine. Aiden, no, the vending machine. Aiden! But I have no stamina. I can't make it. Wait. I've got an idea. Remember the cocktail I served you earlier at the girls' workshop? Neighbors. Exactly. You fell to the first floor. There's some GRE storage down there. Look for white green crates. Inhibitors should be inside. If you take another dose, you should get your strength back. A GR access key is a highly green. It's called a green now. It's a highly sophisticated glitching tool that can unlock special doors and chests marked with a GRE logo. Additionally, it can also be used to discover hidden inhibitor containers. GRE key activates automatically when you're close to an inhibitor container, revealing the distance to its location. Oh, cool. When close to a hidden inhibitor, blah, 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 blah. Okay, got it. That was blah, 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 blah. I guess you uh, missed it. Nope. Aiden, going down, buddy. There we go. See how much loot there is, though, buddy. So much loot. Oh, 
Oh, please stop. <laughs> no need for that. No. Oh. <laughs> I guess this is why you turn the light on. That's locked. Okay. Hey, it's it's through there, isn't it? Easy does it. Easy does it. I wonder why they don't see light. Okay, I was hoping that was silent, and it was. Oh! Back, 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 back. Wait, I just teleported. <clears throat> I can do taking this guy down. There is a crouch position takedown cleared, like a hiding takedown that you can do. I just don't have it unlocked yet. That sounds like it'll be pretty useful to me. Why can't I just kill all of these? I'm getting loads of points. I don't see a reason not to. In theory. Oh, I do for that one, though. Alright, I'm moving, I'm moving. You chill? You chill. I can't do the takedown from the front. Alright. Oh. Can't resist, game. You know, don't you? You know I see something shiny, it's like, well, no aspirin, pigments, asporfin, asporfin, not aspirin. He's not going to find me. All right. So it's gonna make tons of terrifying noises, which is fine. Oh no. Oh no. It's not the time to reminisce. <laughs> oh, damn. Aiden means business. Don't be a chicken, Aiden. Don't be a chicken, Aiden. Be a chicken. I'm just gonna shut this. I think that makes sense. Pigments everywhere. You are doing some serious painting in this hospital. <laughs> uh, right, okay, that's... Let's just grab everything not mandatory first, eh? Just in case, because I suspect Big Boy is going to find us pretty quickly afterwards. And I am stuck to the bloody nines from this place. Bloody hell. Uh... What's this do? Okay. We've got camo breeches. We've got soap. We've got asporfin. We've got resin. Can I change my clothing? Like right now. Do I not have to go to a stupid bloody thing anymore? I don't. Okay, so. Oh, I'm wearing them already. Does it auto equip? Dog is for a ranger. A class specializing in ranged weapons and stealth. Which I am very much not. But, uh. <laughs> Yeah, so I get parkour XP, very, very little, 
Survivor sense lasts a bit longer. That's cool. And stamina. Okay, it's not, it's not useful right now, but still. Inhibitors are the only way to increase your maximum stamina and health. Increasing those attributes is important as it unlocks access to some skills. Each upgrade requires three inhibitors. If you find them, go to the skills menu. Inhibitors can be found in GR Creek crates, hidden inside GR Creek quarantines, and GRE anomaly locations. Additional crates can also be discovered while exploring off the beaten path, which I do love. I hate beaten paths. I like unbeaten paths. You need three inhibitors to upgrade stamina or health, two stamina to be able to climb higher. Yeah, I, th I mean, I think I would even without prompted from the game. Cool. What's up? I took the inhibitor. Fantastic. Go back to the elevator. I'm waiting. It's on a sleepy boy, isn't it? Be a little careful. Oh no, never mind. Music, what you doing? <laughs> I can't. I can't. Where have you gone, buddy? I can't. Okay, that's cool. Harry, I found the markers. Music is so agonizingly, painfully, obviously building to something terrible. <laughs> That's fine. Sometimes it doesn't have to be subtle. A subtle. You were gone a while. How are you feeling? I'm infected, but good to go. Yeah, that's great. Sorry about this. What? Sorry about what? <laughs> about that. On behalf of all its whores, bandits, and idiots, I christen you a citizen of Villador. Fuck. You're about to turn. Get into the light fast. What light? Ah, run. Okay. Run. I'm running. I'm running. No, oh, the big boy. He's large and in charge. What about the loot? <laughs> the sun will save me. I tell you, they were speedy motherfuckers. Ah. That was close. <sighs> well, what would you do without me, Pilgrim? <laughs> I never wanted to become a Pilgrim. I just sort of fell into it. Roamed the country for another reason entirely. I'm looking for my sister. Sister? Yeah, her name is Mia. Fifteen years ago, we were in a hospital together. I think a guy named Waltz was experimenting on us. A lot of nut jobs in the world, huh? Yeah. I have to learn the truth. And then what? And then? What will you do once you find your sister? I haven't thought about that. Well, that's odd. Well, there'll be time for that once I find her. Once you find her? Well, I have a very specific plan. You look like someone with a specific plan. I'd like to live by the ocean. You know, it's supposed to be easier there. <laughs> I always wanted to learn how to surf. What, you find a bunch of old postcards or something? Ah, don't laugh at my dreams, man. I know one thing. I have to get out of this city. It's killing me, right from the inside. Will you help me? The ocean's a long way from here. And we're both infected. People don't want pilgrims for their neighbors. Pfft, fuck people. I will help you with them. And you can help me survive on the road. You know the routes. You know how to survive out in the open. What do you think? We cover each other's asses. How does that sound? That's good. Okay. Let's do it. Awesome. Deal.
You won't regret this, Aiden. I promise. As for your goal, here's the situation around here. After the PK commander was murdered, they blocked the route to the center. They're trying to keep the killer from escaping. To get to Fisheye, we have to outsmart them. But I know when they change the night guard. That will be our chance. I'm gonna get the stuff we'll need for the passage. I have to suss out our odds. Meantime, take a look around. Live a little. Uh, come on. Let me show you something. Just told me to take a look around. I was going to explore. He, he took it away from me. Take a look around the city. Old Villador. Plenty of interesting spots to check out. Okie dokie. Uh... Binoculars allow you to discover important world locations. Hold left on the D pad and press right in. Watch the right corner in the center If it gets smaller, the closer it is to the location that can be discovered. Cool. I have a map. see the church that's where the howlers were after us it's the center of the district built by the night runners soon after the end of the civil war in 2025 using gold furniture and other scrap when operational they can provide a small power to a small settlement unlock faction structures and activate a safe zone the master windmill the magnum opus of the Nightrunner architects as they tried to restore power to the people of the city took almost a year to build. Once operational, it powered most of old Villador. It was seized by peacekeepers after the Nightrunner's dissolution and has been used to power the main terminal in Quarian since then. Where's this, where's this bloody church at? There's something here. No windmill. A willow. I ain't seen this bloody church though. Hello. <laughs> Can I zoom out and in? Ah. Oh god, I can't move. Oh, there it is. That's the bazaar, isn't it? Yeah. Originally, the oh. <laughs> you can find notice boards with missing people around the city. One of them is near the church. Maybe somehow you'll find something about your sister there. And if not, just have fun. The world's already ended, right? How could things get any worse? I'll be back in touch when I've got a handle on things. Well, sounds like you told me to go do some side quests. You've unlocked the open world zoom level. Press R to enter the map. I pressed R. You've unlocked the open world zoom level of your map. All open world activities you discover using the binoculars or during exploration will be visible here. So that's Trinity, Horseshoe, Quarry End. Down to... Oh god, okay. Can we zoom out? Oh. Peacekeeper Territory, Survivor Territory... Renegade territory. Okay, those are the three factions. So, we've got safe zone. See, that's this activity lock, so I haven't unlocked the ability to get these windmills yet. Activity unavailable. Survivor territory. Pumpkin farm. Adorable. I guess they want me to go over here, right? Welcome to Villador. You have now unlocked the open world of Villador. Your first goal is to visit the survivors, hope at the bazaar, and you'll find a merchant, a resting place, and a stash. Use the binoculars and sway the area to reveal additional locations on the map, like windmills, which activate new safe zones. There are plenty of places like these in the city where you discover them. As you explore the world, watch your compass for encounters. They offer you a chance to help the citizens for XP and rewards. Wait, can I now? Oh, wait, what? What's happening? You're right, buddy. Well, I want to see what just happened. <laughs> Tons of stuff just happened simultaneously. Okay. So, accessories. We can now make throwing knives. It's pretty cool. Uh, do I not have any medicine? I can make some medicine. A bit more medicine. Just in case. 
Uh, I wonder how I level up a crafting recipe, actually, now that I think about it. No idea. Uh, inventory. Okay, so we've got a new weapon. We've got the billy hook. Oh, it's a beast. Okay, those are my two best weapons. I'm just going to keep them all on me, I guess, until I've maxed out, and then I'll chuck out the ones I don't think are any good. I didn't get any gear, did I? No, it seems to auto equip better gear anyway, so. Uh, skills. Nearly there. Nearly there on both of those. 6,126 inhibitors. Okay. Alright, well, good time to end it. So what we'll do in the next video, we'll go help that dude out, uh, the uh, blue marker, then we'll head over to the bazaar, start doing some side quests, talk to merchants, all that kind of general open world game stuff. The game has officially, I think, just begun, basically. <laughs> it literally just started. Now, uh, this I think around two hours is probably around when the games usually do start, so it's not that surprising, which is crazy though. Like, some smaller indie titles, like really good games you could finish in two hours. The world's a crazy place. Okay, I'm enjoying it so far though. If handles great, combat's more enjoyable. Although I haven't really done any combat this video at all, actually, other than that little session on the roof. The game looks and feels better. It feels like it's got less of that Eastern European jankiness that Dying Light had. You know, and I don't mean that as a slight against Eastern European developers. It's just that I, I, if you watch my playthrough in Dying Light One, you'll have remembered at one point I said this game. Pretty sure it's made by an Eastern European developer, having no knowledge of that myself, because it just they the games tend to have a certain feel in how they play, but I'd say it's it's pretty uh cleaned up this one. So far. I did have that weird book last video, but a bookless hour right here. <laughs> Thanks for joining me. Cheers much as always. Bye-bye.